for you, Greg. Yeah, you see the big Von Miller banner behind us here at the stadium. Of course, the Broncos are on a bye week, so no flattening of quarterbacks for Von Miller this week, but apparently filing of some heavy-duty paperwork. In his six years as a Denver Bronco, Von Miller has packed quite the resume on and off the field. Now, some might worry one moment in Mexico could muddy his reputation. According to court documents, a woman he apparently met in Cancun, Elizabeth Ruiz, contacted TMZ and a well known sex tape broker trying to sell a sex tape, unless Miller ponied up two and a half million dollars. The star linebacker has gone to court to try and stop the release of the video recorded on his cell phone. According to those court documents, Ruiz wanted to sell the recording and become the next Kim Kardashian. It really does come down to, I guess, the overall consensus of the consumer. Dan Price is president of Adrenaline Inc., specializing in brand development and analysis. If a fan is not really bothered by the actions of a, of a celebrity through their personal life, then chances are the sponsor isn't going to react. He says image and perception of that image have many layers. But if the fans are, are in an uproar over, the react, of, over this behavior, then the sponsor has no choice but to pull that relationship before they lose product, uh, before they lose consumer sales. We have all these kids that, you know, they, they all love on Miller. Broncos country seems to have Miller's back. I think it's terrible um, if she's trying to extort money from him. He's a, he's a good athlete. He's good to the community. Um, so that's really what I care about as a fan. We need to be unified, and, and to me, to be able to support a guy that's so active in the community like Von Miller, you know, we'll do that. Neither the Broncos nor Miller's attorneys uh, are commenting outside my.